Welcome back. Now, this is far from the murder on the Orient Express, but there is a real life train caper here in Western New York. As we told you last night, Buffalo police are looking for this train. Looks nice, right? And the trailer it was contained in. As Jeff Rusak shows us, this train right here, no ordinary toy. It's quiet here on Lee Street in South Buffalo. A passing train, deer in a field. It's even quiet inside the Discovery Heritage Center. We try to um, collect the objects that have a story behind them. That's Stephen Kosis. He's a keeper of these stories. It once operated uh, in a little amusement park uh, in Cheektowaga called Liberty, uh, Liberty Amusement Park. He's speaking with me to tell me a story he wished he didn't have to about one of the most beloved artifacts of the Western New York Railway Historical Society, the 1957 Railmaster Amusement Park train. So I come in on Tuesday morning and discover that the chain had been cut. A trailer storing the train was gone. We figured it happened early Sunday morning, but we didn't discover it till Tuesday. So they had quite a head start. The black SUV even ran over the remaining tracks. Kosis calls the train used to spark the love of trains in younger generations priceless. We are torn between if they knew what was inside the trailer or if they were just after the trailer and they got a big surprise when they opened it up. There's only two or three of those type trains in existence anymore and maybe only one other one that's operating. Buffalo police say they are following leads. They're asking anyone with information on the SUV or the missing train to call their tip line. Kosa says he's more interested in getting the train back than pressing charges. So one day, this whole thing will be another story. In Buffalo, Jeff Rusak, 7 Eyewitness News.